Welcome to AFC Meets. My name is Ray and I'm here today with Matt Hodgson. Matt Hodgson is five and three, fights out of AVT, and he will be making his AFC debut at uh, Almighty Fighter Championship 3. Matt, thank you for joining yeah, me. No problem. Right, I just want to have a little chat with you really and uh, get, some information off, get some information off you, find a little, out a little bit about you and uh, talk a little bit about your up and coming fight. So, how would you describe your fighting style? Um, my fighting style's well, I mean, it's mainly stand-up. Um, I am sharpening up my, my toes on the ground. Um, I don't believe in MMA, you're going to be an all-round fighter. Um, so I've got to be ready for anything. So, um, more of a stand-up, but I'm, I'm learning my ground game pretty quick. It's fair to say, I mean, you're training at one of the uh, the biggest gyms in, in, in the UK. Yeah. UK, obviously, training with Danny Mitchell, of course, fought in the UFC, fought in mm -hmm. Bellator, fought in ACB. So, what's it like training with somebody like that, and how much does, how much does it, that help you with your own game? Um, Danny, I mean, he's an absolute inspiration to, to me and, and the lads at AVT. Um, and, you know, to roll with him uh, and just to learn from him um, is, is, is excellent. You pick up the slightest little things um, that you wouldn't normally think of. And he, he teaches you <coughs> uh, the basics and, and, and lets you learn it through simple terms. Um, so you pick it up a lot quicker. He is, of course, the only man to have two twister finishes professionally in mixed martial arts. I've got to ask you, has he twisted you? No, he's not twisted me actually. He has tried on numerous times. Um, I've managed just to stick it out till the end of the round, saved by the bell both times. <laughs> well, I was there at Bellator when he did it, it was absolutely yeah. un unbelievable. Okay, this is going to be your first fight, obviously, on Almighty Fighting Championship. We know you've had eight fights previously. Yeah. So, what are your thoughts of, of, have you looked at the venue? What's your thoughts on the O2 Academy as a venue? Um, I've never been inside it, to be honest. Uh, I've heard good things from the previous shows that you've had. Um, and I can't wait just to get in there and uh, see the venue and do the business. Now, what do you, you're fighting against a guy, Michael Yannick. He's, he's only had one fight, which is unusual to have someone with semi fights against someone with only one fight. But I mean, he, he's AFCW. He did look quite good. I don't know if you've watched the footage or not. What are your yeah. views on him as an opponent? What did you think of, of his one fight? Um, yeah, I've seen his fight. Uh, he seems very judo based. Um, you know, he wears suplexing and hip throws. He's not really worrying me, to be fair. Um, I'm, I'm ready to go now. Um, I'm just sharpening up a few, a few more tools, um, and I think that he's going to have a shock in there against against me, especially. Yeah. How's your weight going? I mean, that's a big thing for fighters is managing weight. So, what what are you like on fight week? How much weight do you have to get ready get rid of to be ready for fight night? Um, to be fair, the weight's coming off pretty pretty good. Um, I am normally heavier uh, this this far out from a fight. Um, it's coming off nice and quick. Um, no serious cutting really. Um, the last week, I may have to cut a little bit of water, I'm hoping not. Um, so we'll just see what that weight is on, on the final week and then go from there. Now, we've already talked a little bit about AVT, of course, it is one of the biggest gyms in the country and of course definitely massive around this area. Yeah. Now, we've got a lot of guys on, on our card from AVT, which isn't really a surprise because it is, like I say, one of the best gyms. What you, what, what's, what's it mean to you to have so many of your guys fighting, so many of your teammates fighting on the same card as you? Um, it's good as, as, a, as a gym and as teammates, we're like, like a tight-knit family, um, you know, brothers and we help each other out all the way um, on wins and losses. And to have people alongside you, um, you know, fighting on the same card, we all help each other, push each other to, to get those wins, um, especially with Danny Mitchell in your corner, um, Josh Collins, Jason Furness. Um, you know, you seem to fight harder and better just to also, you know, obviously get the win, but you know, to prove to Danny that, that you know what the time he's put into the to the team and everything, you know, he's he's doing well. Um so yeah, we all just help each other out really. Okay. We're we're about three weeks out now. A AFC three is taking place on the 29th of October. Why should people come and see you fight? Um personally I mean if, if people have seen me fight before, um I'm a, I'm an explosive fighter, I'm an aggressive fighter. Um, I always have been, and, um, I'm liking to, well I'm wanting to, to go in there and prove a point, um, not only to my fans but to, to you know, um, other people watching that I'm in business when I go in there, you know, I train hard um, and when I go in there I like to showcase my skills um, and do the business, um, so please come and watch me, you know, tickets are still available, um, grab them for a great venue and a great fight that's going to be. Right, I know that, um, I already know the answer to this question, but I'm going to ask you anyway, because I've looked at your record and I know how, how you enjoy your wins come. How are you going to win this, knockout or submission? 
I will be going for the knockout, yeah. Um, if the submission, um, you know, if I see the submission now, take the submission. Um, out of the five wins I've had, they've had four knockouts out of those five. So, uh, yeah, number five could be on its way. Well, thank you very much for joining me today, Matt. I appreciate no it. And good luck with your fight on the 29th of October.